Hi, this is Sandy Joe from RhinestoneTemplates.com, and I'm working over a little vector um, file. We're going to make this into a vector file here, and um, just bringing you guys with me so you can see how this all works. And I'm working in WinPC Sign 2014, but this can be used in a lot of different programs, the same effect. Um, I had somebody send me a file, and they want this cut out um, in, a, in a vector file because they want to use it for Father's Day. So um, I went ahead and I have a JPEG here, so um, this isn't a vector file at all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to come over to my toolbar on the right-hand side, and I'm just going to... There'd be two ways of doing this, actually. You could just redraw it, you know, with your, your tools and your construction points and stuff. But in a really um, easy way is in WinPC 2014 in FunTime. They have a great vector tool that vectorizes a lot of stuff really easy, especially it's if in if it's in the black and white or the gray scale like this it's super easy so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna come over first I'm gonna select um, my image here and then I'm gonna come over to my auto vector and I'm just gonna automatically vector it I'm just gonna bring in my vector wand down here my magic wand I'm just gonna hit it and it shows what it looks like before what it's gonna look like after I only want two colors I just want black and white um, so I'm gonna leave it and then it goes ahead and it makes it and it sets it next to us. So I'm going to get rid of these because I don't need those anymore. This is my JPEG, my little snippet that I had made. Um, this was a little blurb down here. We can get rid of um, that. And then um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to come in here to wireframe. I'm just going to look and see what my lines look like and make sure all my lines look good for cutting. And they all look pretty good for cutting. Um, I'm making this into a heat transfer um, for a t-shirt for someone so um, that looks good and at this point this is a vector um, file that can be used um, however you want to use it um, you can go ahead and, and um, cut out a vinyl or you can take it and you can see that it has the different layers with it um, or you can take and make it into a card decal or whatever but I just want to show you guys how easy it is to vectorize um, different products in this this program and in Corel is a great one for vectorizing and and doing a trace with too so um, again this was just using the auto vector tool thank you